Good morning! I am currently not on time. Why? Because I just spent the last freaking seven minutes trying to set up my tripod and I literally just taped it to my dash. For some reason, the tape wasn't sticking today. So we're gonna see how far we can make it until this falls apart. Monday. It's currently 7.26 in the morning and I'm on my way to school. God, I really don't want to talk while this turn signal is on because it's really just going to annoy me. So if you didn't know, I am a junior in college and I am a commuter student. So that means I drive to school every day because I don't live on campus. I wanted to take you guys through a day in my life. I feel like I've done i don't even know like i feel like i haven't done many of these this semester because i have two online classes so i'm not even really at school that much because i only go to school for three classes but next semester i'm supposed to be taking 18 credits so and all of them are in person classes like none of them are online so i'll be at school a lot so i'm gonna be doing a lot of school vlogs next semester today i actually have a few things on the agenda which is like i typically don't have to be at school for as long as i'm gonna be there today but i have class and then i have a little bit of a break and then i have a lab and then i have another break and then i have to meet with a group for a group project so i'm just gonna stay at school and i guess just do work or something until that meeting because i have like a couple hours in in between and there's no point in going home oh my god like people just drive in the middle of the road like are you good before we go on with this video i just want to stop right here and apologize in advance for how loud my car is while i'm driving i feel like i had to yell over my car so hopefully you can hear me but yeah sorry in advance for that i'm drinking a protein shake this morning for my breakfast i just started doing this again i did this like every day my senior year of high school yeah i'm drinking this premier protein shake it's actually pretty good i mean it does taste a little bit like chalk but but what else can I expect from a protein shake? I should probably have included this in the beginning, but I filmed my outfit of the day, so I'm gonna cut to that now so you can see what I'm wearing today. Just a little disclaimer that I'm filming this after I just got home from school. I've been gone for like a solid seven hours, so I looked better when I first left and I was still all fresh and whatnot. But anyway, all right, so my hoodie is from Airy. My jean jacket is thrifted. My leggings are from Airy. They're the ones I always wear, you guys know. And then my shoes are my Air Force Ones. I have on these hoops from Target and then I am wearing my Daniel Wellington ring and my Daniel Wellington watch. And this video was actually sponsored by Daniel Wellington. So thank you to Daniel Wellington for sponsoring today's video. I don't know if you guys know this, but I've actually been working with Daniel Wellington for a while. I was a college campus ambassador for them my first two years of college. So like I said, I'm wearing two Daniel Wellington products today. I love their products. I genuinely do. They are such nice quality. They're beautiful. They're elegant. I'm really a fan of Daniel Wellington and I have been for years. So today I'm wearing one of their classic rings and I am just absolutely obsessed with this. I think it's so dainty and you guys know that I love dainty jewelry. I'm also wearing their new iconic link watch which I'm obsessed with this. I have I think three other Daniel Wellington watches but I just think that the iconic link is amazing and I'm so glad that they finally made a watch like this. The other ones that I wanted to show you guys really quick are the Petite Durham watch and what I really like about these types of watches basically all of their watches except for the iconic link you can switch out the straps so you can literally get one watch and then just buy straps for it and it's like you have like five different watches when you're not actually buying five different watches you know what i mean i think that that's a really cool thing and that's something i really love about jenny wellington but the iconic link watch strap is customizable to your wrist so you can make sure that it fits right and then i also have the classic cuff rose gold bracelet and i'm just a sucker for rose gold another really dainty piece that i really like especially with the holidays coming up daniel wellington is an amazing place to shop for anybody in your life if you want to get them something really nice a really nice piece of jewelry i have personally bought some of my friends and family daniel wellington products in the past for christmas so so if you guys want to check out Daniel Wellington, all the information and links are going to be in the description and you can go to their website, danielwellington.com and use my code Hannah Elise for 15% off of your purchase. So again, thank you to Daniel Wellington for sponsoring today's video and let's get back to the vlog. Um, So a little bit of a life update, I guess, on how I'm doing in college right now. Since I've transferred, I made a whole video about transferring and also I made a first week of school vlog and there was like a lot of anxiety in that first week and I've gotten some DMs from you guys, which is so 
sweet. Thank you for caring and reaching out and asking how I'm doing. I've gotten DMs asking me how I'm doing with transferring and like if I've gotten more comfortable and I definitely have. I feel so much better. I literally, like that anxiety that I felt in the first day of school, I don't typically feel like that and that is amazing. I'm really happy and I've just gotten more comfortable with the fact that like I'm in a new environment. I'm adapting, I feel like. So I definitely think I'm doing better. As far as being a commuter, since this video is kind of like a day in my life commuter student type of deal, I love it. I love living at home. I love that I'm saving money. And living on campus is expensive, like for no reason. I am already in a lot of debt, so I really don't need to be doing that. Even though I do spend money on gas, like more so than, sorry, this car is definitely trying to like cut me off right now. That's why I'm kind of speed racing it a little bit. Anyway, yeah, I love it. It's been so amazing for my mental health. And that's honestly like a big reason why I made this decision because my mental health was so 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 bad i feel like i've gotten so much more of my creativity back and i'm able to you know make videos that i really want to make and i feel like i have all the resources like i have my car here i can just drive to like the store and like pick up stuff like i don't have to take like the subway or anything i'm really glad that i made this decision it's probably one of the best decisions i've ever made in my life okay you're supposed to stop before the train tracks does anyone know how to drive that's i'm asking for a friend why are we stopping the light is green the light is green what the Idiots. I guess one of the downsides to driving to school is just that people just don't know how to drive. All right, so I think that's all I wanted to say. And I'm gonna be at school soon. So I'll see you guys, I guess, in class. Hi, it's voiceover Hannah, and this is who you're going to be listening to now because there was no way in hell I was going to talk throughout this entire vlog at school. So I'm going to be narrating what I'm doing. So I right now am in my first class of the day. I'm being a great student. I'm working on my project. So after this class, I have a lab and I didn't show that because it's awkward. And I don't know anybody in there. So anyway, fast forward to after that, and then I am walking to the library to basically waste time because I have two hours until I need to meet with my group. I actually didn't just waste time, I got some work done. Something I really like to do on Mondays, which it was Monday when I filmed this, is go through my agenda and write down what I need to do every day of the week to make sure I get all my assignments done. So I spent a good chunk of time allocating tasks to each day of this week. I think that that really helps me to stay organized and get everything done that I need to. So at this point, I was just getting bored because I did the work that I needed to do, but I didn't really have motivation to do anything else, but I really couldn't go home because I still had that meeting. So this was just me complaining. And then I was really, really hungry. So I decided to walk back to Starbucks, which I had already been to once to get a coffee. And I got a breakfast sandwich just so I didn't pass out from hunger. In this clip, I'm happy because I'm about to go home for the day. an egg oh my god hi i just got home <sighs> feels so good i don't even remember the last time i was at school for that long like honestly probably high school like i literally got there at like seven something and i left at like two something like that's i feel like i'm back in high school menace the misery well anyway it was a long day if you guys want to know the truth the reason ugh, and my nose ring always sticks out like i just want to sue i feel like the reason that i don't make a lot of college vlogs is because i feel like if i'm gonna make a college vlog then i have to like vlog like literally every single second of my entire day and a lot of the time i just don't want to pull my camera out in the middle of an area where there are a lot of people so then i stress myself out because i am like basically telling myself like if you don't film every single thing you do then the content isn't going to be good there isn't even going to be enough content and it's no one's going to care no one's going to like that so basically that's why I just feel like I don't really do a lot of college vlogs. I mean, I don't even I feel like I did I did some when I was at my old school and I'm definitely going to be doing a lot more next semester like I said earlier because I'm going to be taking 18 credits. So, I'm going to be at school for pretty much all day every day, so I'll have a lot more, you know, content to give you of me being at school, but this semester has been pretty chill, I'm not going to lie. Thank God. And I've only had to go to school for 3 classes, so I'm not really there that much. And I know you guys love college vlogs and I want to make them. I love making vlogs. I love editing vlogs. Vlogs are my favorite videos to edit for sure because I feel like I can do like the most with them editing wise, but that's just kind of why I don't make them all the time. And I also feel like it gets really repetitive because like I said, I only have three classes at school. So I feel like I'm just showing you the same exact thing. And then as soon as I'm done my like one class for the day, I'll come home and just, I feel like what I do 
the rest of the day is just not interesting enough to vlog. Today's my first day in a while that I actually had to stay at school, but I also was exhausted and grumpy, so I feel like I didn't really vlog that much, but I just wanted to say that because I don't want to, I don't know, I want you guys to know how I'm feeling. But anyway, yeah, that's that. I could literally take like a seven year nap right now. Like I'm being really dramatic, but at the same time, I'm just really tired. I don't even have enough energy to watch The Vampire Diaries, so that's how you know I'm really, really tired. But I also don't know if I want to take a nap. Yeah, maybe I do want to take a nap. Oh my god, I could fall asleep right now. Alright, I feel like I'm just gonna go take my contacts out and take a little nap because I am so tired. Okay, I'm gonna go do that. Good night. This shouldn't come as a surprise to anybody, but I didn't make an outro. So that is the end of today's video. If you guys have stayed until this point in the video, comment down below. I'm a real one because you're a real one. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys next week.